The color screen, commonly found on desktops, is a powerful visualization medium. The telephone, another common desktop apparatus, is, on the other hand, not very visual. As new phone services are introduced, the interface between the telephone and the user should be rethought. The screen project attempts to improve the interface to voice messages. Currently, the blinking lights of an answering machine or the touchtone commands of a voicemail system are the common ways to access voice messages. The goal of the screen project is to create a rich visual environment for navigating voice messages. The recipient is presented with images that each represent a voice message and together they provide overview for selecting and sorting messages. The screen project borrows its name from the work of art by Edward Munch, which to most people expresses an intense high-pitched hysterical female scream. This is a highly advanced visualization of an oral message and, if presented to you by your answering machine, expresses several characteristics of the caller. A computer does not exhibit the artistic sophistication of an Edward Munch, but through simple audio analysis, the machine can guess the gender and the age of the caller. The intensity of the cartoon figures reflect the pitch of the caller. The female gender is represented by the color red, and the cartoon figure has long hair. Men, on the other hand, tend to lose their hair. The system also tries to characterize the message by computing an excitement factor. The excited caller deserves a colorful icon, while the monotone speaker will be represented by a monochrome icon. The color characteristics that we choose to visualize in the screen environment are easy to compute, yet useful for the recipient. If computationally possible, we would also like to convey the emotions of the caller and the topic of the message. The user interface of the screen project lacks the affirmation of formal user testing. However, judging from using the system and the frustration many people express when using regular voicemail systems, we believe the computer screen has the potential of becoming the preferred medium for voice message navigation.